types of charges in this module we will learn about the types of charges and their interaction there are two types of charges namely positive charge and the negative charge now let us perform some activities to understand the types of charges take two rubber balloons and inflate them tie a thread at the mouths of each of the balloon and hang them to that two nails in the wall separately so that they will not touch each other now rub the balloons one by one with woolen cloth we can find that both the balloons are repelling each other now take two plastic straws and rub one of the straws with polythene and place it carefully in a glass jar now rub the other straw also with polythene bring it close to the charged straw in the jar we can find that both the straws are repelling each other now rub a straw and place it gently in a glass jar and bring an inflated and charged balloon near the straw now we can observe that the charged balloon is attracted towards charged straw this indicates that the charge on the balloon is of a different kind from the charge on the straw and there are two kinds of charges we can also say that the charges of the same kind repel each other while charges of different kind attract each other the electric charges generated by rubbing are static they do not move by themselves when charges move they constitute an electric current for example the current in a circuit which makes a bulb glow is nothing but a motion of charges now let us know about the transfer of charge the device used to test whether an object is carrying charge or not is called as electroscope now let us prepare a simple electroscope take an empty glass bottle take a piece of cardboard slightly bigger in size than the mouth of the bottle and make a hole in it and insert a metal paper clip open out paper clip and cut two strips of aluminum foil about 4 cm into 1 cm each hang them on the paper clip insert the paper clip in the cardboard lid so that it is vertically hanged charge a straw and touch it with the end of the paper clip we find that electrical charge can be transferred from a charged object to another through a metal conductor touch the end of the paper clip gently with hand and you will find a change in paper clip and in the foil strips they come back to their original state repeat charging of foil strips and touching the paper clip every time we observe that the foil strips collapse as soon as we touch the paper clip with hand the reason is that the foil strips lose charge to the earth through your body we say that the foil strips are discharged the process of transferring of charge from a charged object to the earth is called earthing thus earthing is provided in buildings to protect us from electric shocks due to any leakage of electric current